my cacti collections. Look how cute it looks. Then, oh, ho. photo bomber. How cute it looks when a bonsai flowers. Isn't it? I had never seen this particular bonsai uh, flower before. Because I used to be a crazy bonsai collector. Uh, not uh, bonsai, sorry, cacti. Cactus collector when in my childhood days. Oh, it is such a such a cute memory to have. I had never seen uh, any bonsai, sorry, um, cactus of this variety flowering before. Love to watch even this flowering. And do you, does, does any jade flower? I don't know. If at all anybody is having the information, please give it to me. I am I'm having many more uh, to pot uh, like this as one size. Stina, get down. Like this. See, it has been potted like this with a little bit of aeration or a few holes to hang this from the top. And there is one hole, one hole at the bottom. Here it is. Now, see, here is one more large hole. And I am having, no, that is the only hole, hole made at the bottom, sorry, middle part of the shell, almost. So, in summer, April, uh, uh, a terrific summer, when these cactus, cacti need more of water, more of water to survive, that will stay here until here. Water will be there always. Complete water will not get drained off. So I can keep it in on the two rooftop without any problems. Same is the case with this. This is not having any holes. One single hole is there. A small hole is there. So even if the, the draining does happen, it will happen in very... Very small quantity. I want to plant one of my lily, lily into this, or else use it for some other purpose. And they cute. These little pots of coconut shell. <laughs> It is perfect in shape. Perfect. See, I'm rotating it. It is so perfect. If mounted on a base, uh, it is going to be a, it can be a um, tabletop pen stand or it can be a pot for my water lilies. It can be a, a flower vase to do arrangements, flower arrangements for, for your tabletop. So this is it about my bonsai collections, my cacti collections. My, I am collecting all the cactus in such shells, so obviously they will become bonsais. I can pot one more. Uh, see, I can pot those 
aloevera variety into one of one such shell and arrange it along with this i am having this this aloe vera as well i am having two three varieties of aloe vera yet to be potted so stay tuned with my channel with me to get much more uh, such cute cactus as well as much more plant life and and uh, animal life and insect life whatever is there around me i am going to cover it all for you these are yet to bloom let them bloom once they bloom i will take the pictures along with this and post the same for you oh wow i am having three blooms today three blooms i never thought that this is going to bloom even it is bloomed this is the older one and this is the fresh bloom i always want to take a close picture of the fresh fresh bloom why because see some water will be there inside and he this cute is yet to bloom the arrangements of uh, uh what do you call that man the male part of the uh, that particular thing are so very perfectly arranged i'll come back and shoot continue with the video after the complete bloom happens here it is it is bloomed but not it completely the center part is yet to open up it has not opened up yet or maybe it has blue it did bloom yesterday itself i haven't might have not observed it if at all it, it was a fresh bloom it it should have been like this let's see focus focus ha ah, like this with completely opening the female part to the male part of the flower okay well, going by the that uh, what do you call that man the male part this pollen yeah that's it the one that are carrying the pollen here they doesn't seem to be that of a fresh bloom it had it had bloomed yesterday itself i might not have observed it that's exactly why the center part now he, here the center part is closed see it is closed it is having some purpose so once first day gets over and the second day by the time uh, it blooms on the second day the female part of the flower will be closed for for in for any additional fertilization happening i don't know how exactly this this variety is uh, does the propagation i haven't observed any viviparous uh, behavior till till date but this is how i have planted it in a nice cute uh, coconut shell it is having only about uh, see 1 2 1 2 3 4 oh yeah four leaves that's it fifth one is coming up the soil that have have provided the shell the plant is so very perfect and and uh, some damage have might have happened to this here even then it can give some nutrition to the plant i'll pluck it off once this fresh leaves comes out stay proper
that's it so i was expecting uh that this is a fresh bloom and i wanted to show the same to you yeah, could not do it for today next time i say i'll place all the varieties that i am having in the shells this like this isn't it cute i can accommodate many shells into one such one such tub and one fine day i will get about uh, half a dozen of them flowering sing- in a single container of this size that's it for today have a nice day keep tuned to my channel to get much more that of roof gardening See? much more that of bonsai is that my my curry leaf uh, plant is in bloom here it is it's in bloom all the branches are going to flower and that is going to be a very cute and beautiful things to watch upon this is it my plants this is the we are called it exora right exora planted uh, to grow as in hydroponic method how much more will be recorded and supplied uploaded for you keep tuned that's it for today